Hello guys and welcome to another episode of Forever Stranded Lost Souls, the new pack by G.W. Sheridan, which we are playing on the Voxel Squad server, aren't you? Do you want to become a Voxel Squad member? I think we're recruiting. Do you play Minecraft, mate? Anyway, welcome back. And today I am hoping to achieve something very exciting. I am hoping to not put set my place on fire i am hoping to get obsidian before we venture i think i figured out how to do it before we go into the obsidian getting quest though i want to make an atomic reconstructor constantan plates and all these how do we get black quartz I hope, okay, we sift soul sand on an iron stiffened mesh, okay, uh, well, so the thing, I, I did this already, but in the last episode, but I've kind of forgotten where I've put it, so I'm going to make it again, so to make a chopping block, you do this, right, and there we go. There we go. We have some chopping blocks. Okay, let me sift some. Let me sift some soul sand. And the reason I think I'd better explain. I don't think I've explained things very well. The reason I really want the soul sand. Well, not the soul sand. The reason I really want the atomic reconstructor is because actually I want to make an auto breaker because this is my favorite way of getting obsidian. And the other breaker is very simple, but you need the void crystal and you need, oh my God, this is changed. Filament, okay. <laughs> let me get, I'll make some filaments off camera. Let me get some salt and I'll be back with. All right, guys, it is possible that we have everything we need, we need to make this. So we need four constant tan these which luckily I have made there we go and for iron I think which also luckily I have made and we need to make a block of this this took forever to save it's such a nice texture though but it took forever all right and we have this iron plates and this oh it needs, oh dear, accept any stick wood. So why is it not? Oh, because I don't have, haha. Uh -huh. Yes, for the want of sticks. I can't believe I was, so this is quite expensive. Now I believe these unstable ingots are actually stable, right? But it is quite expensive. It needs 18 diamond. So there we go. Okay, there might be stable, but uh, doesn't mean we're completely safe. Jesus. Okay, so can we make this? There we go. And now can we make this? Yes, atomic reconstructor. Is this not fantastic? Oh, we completed iron casing. So now... Where can I put, if I put it here, just temporarily, I need to take this off. I'm gonna put it here and I'm going to set it to pulse. Okay, and then we're gonna put this button on it. And that should, ah, okay. Well, let it, and what we need is a couple, at the moment, let's just take a couple of coal blocks. And I don't know whether it's got enough power. It does have enough power. Okay. Yes. Beautiful. Finally, my armor is really beat up and I was going to repair it. But then I thought, you know, there is better armor that I can have. Now that I have my 
in fact let's turn this off so we can get the power in let's put this sorry on. i don't know that one you don't know much do you alexa but that's okay i know stuff so it's fine we are sorry, not lost i don't know that one okay so i've made some filaments i have made some filaments i mean we're making good progress but at the same time the difficulty just keeps going up and up and i've been killed a few times which makes me think that uh auto breaker i mean we got to this time what is this automatic breaker embers uh we need this which we need copper for but we have copper let's put this i'm gonna have to make a i'm gonna have to tidy up to like a tidy up of my stuff because i just have so much stuff it's embarrassing anyway can we do this um what if the axe keeps interfering but there we have this and one two three four six seven was it seven that we needed and now it has worked beautiful all right so now we have to find the obsidian don't we so i thought that before i go to find the obsidian i thought that i might make myself some armor because my armor is really breaking and i don't want to spend i don't want to spend a uh, xp point i don't want it to break i don't want to spend uh, XP and diamonds repairing armor that I'm gonna probably give up on very soon and I'm sure most of you know where all this is going there we go there we go why is my place so full emeraldic crystal this this and this and a couple of emeraldic crystals to spare and i hope i've checked and it told me that i could wear this yeah, looks like i can the requirements in 10 gathering nine buildings so that's hardly hardly excessive and this gives me much better this is actually much better than the diamond armor i just i need to um i just need to uh let's take let's take a couple of uh, maybe just a couple of stacks of this in case we need to build uh where am i oh i lost my way right so i think so what we need you probably all know about this because many people have shown it already but what we need for making obsidian is the uh icy biome in the nether and there is such a thing because that has hot springs in it and uh i actually found the icy biome when i was mining on this level so i'll just get there just just straight ahead of us i'll get there and i'll be back with you all right so here we are <laughs> this is icy nether rack and basically i think i'm just gonna pull her up it's not gonna be easy with another rack you know because it's so so easy to break but at least i'm getting the xp i'm just gonna pull her up until i get to the top okay guys and here we are so it was a little bit difficult to get to here because of all the uh, i was digging underneath there oh my god i don't know what that is but that does not look good does he see me i think he does 
That looks very bad indeed. Uh, how can I get that? I think I actually probably want to be over there. <laughs> so maybe this isn't the best place to be. I don't know. <laughs> Let me try. Okay, guys. So, uh, yeah. I thought I was going to drown in the nether, but here is one of those hot streams that is going to make... And also, I seem to be in a fortress. I'm not sure if that's exactly what I intended. Uh, I mean, fortress is lovely. And this is definitely the biome we want to be in. But uh, I want to be somewhere close to lava. To be perfectly honest with you. So I might explore this fortress a bit. Although that wasn't the original plan. But also I just want to... I want to find my way out so I can find some lava. There should be some lava ahead of us. So what I want is one of those pools close to lava. Because unfortunately I didn't bring any kind of tank with me. So that was a little bit of a miscal, of a lack of calculation. Wow, look at this ice, all this ice in, all this ice in the nether. That's kind of, that is something. Right, I'll find a suitable place where we can be. What happens if I break this ice? Nothing. I don't have silk touch on me, I guess. Right. I will find a suitable place for our adventure and I'll get back to you. All right. So this is far from perfect, but I guess it's as good as it will get. Uh, so we have this. What we want to do is make a bit of flowing water. And in fact, okay, this will do. If I stand here and I put this here, perfect. This is a little bit far from lava, but what can you do? Okay, let's get some lava. Oh, I wish I had like a whole drum of lava, but I'm sure soon we'll be able to make pumps and all sorts of things. Ah, that's that bit of lava gone. Oh, we have more lava here. <laughs> Unfortunately, I didn't bring any kind of tank with me, which was idiotic because, you know, because of that, I'm forced to do all this running to and fro, but I think we see it's just gathering all the obsidian for me, which is beautiful. And I can make quite a bit of obsidian. Unfortunately, you can't place this, you know, like you can take a bucket of this. Like so, but you can't place it, so it's not, we have to bring the lava to the water or whatever this fluid is. But I killed another, I got another red heart, I don't know if you can see, so I'm now up to one orange heart, so that is at least pretty good. The bad thing is that the mobsters now have so much so much health points it just takes forever to kill them and it's actually quite boring even if i'm in control it is still boring to do it how are we doing 13 that's not really enough for what i wanted to do so i will keep the keep at this for a bit longer boring though it is and i will see you in a bit Okay, guys, uh, I'm trying to avoid that gas. I, she was attacking me, but... Oh! Oh, what the heck? What the heck? What the heck? I've had the most 
the most scary trip down here, honestly. It was very, very scary. I went underground. Oh, look at that. There is that guy. I had to go underground and then... Um, how is my armor doing? Well, at least it's not very damaged. I and I was going to just dig my way underground, but um, I don't really want to take that guy on. Maybe he didn't see me. I'll look at that. Of course, he saw me coming in a straight way to me. I was going underground, but then my pick broke, and it was very stupid of me because I realized that I had a couple of hammers. So if I if I had just you know if I just changed the hammer before the pick broke completely, it would recover some durability. But anyway, I had to come over ground. But anyway, I am here, and I have thirty obsidian, and all sorts of other things like uh, protection to chain. Well, you know, I mean this this is a pretty good one. But these are only really worth anything if I can get the protection or okay, case scroll. Okay, I could technically use this, but these are only really worth it to me if I can take the enchantments of them. Now here is the eight obsidian. So that's a nice decent num amount of obsidian. And one of the things I'm gonna do probably is put a couple of uh, reinforcement things on the pick, but this will have to, to happen at another time. I am all very, very tired now. I think that was, that was an Enderman. Yeah, I am really, really quite tired now. So uh, I think I am going to finish here. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you next time.